Whether you're managing a team member struggling to meet their numbers or a seasoned top performer, a sales dashboard can simplify sales cycles and help you identify where your sales team is and exactly where you need to take them. The best sales managers always seem to be one step ahead of the game. They have a sixth sense for detecting smoking campfires and putting them out before they become raging forest fires. But not everyone has that sixth sense that allows them to notice the minute changes in sales performance or the tiny hiccup in what may appear to be decent numbers. With the sales dashboard, you have the sales tools that can quickly catch these bumps in the road before they sideline your deals and damage your numbers. Let us try and understand what the corporate sales dashboard offers the sales managers. This dashboard provides three different levels of analysis. The corporate level, the regional level, and the city level. In the corporate panel, you can analyze the corporate revenue and the regional performance, year-to-year -year data as a gauge and bar, respectively. The line graph in the regional performance section allows you to choose the months for which you want to see the regional performance with the help of the slider. You can hover over a specific data point on the graph to display a tool tip showing the series, category, and value. With the help of the slider, you can analyze the regional performance line graph for a range of months. To see the category performance over time, Click the play button in the category analysis section. Hovering on a particular bubble gives the unit sold, revenue, and profit margin values for a specific category for a single year. The subcategory analysis grid displays metric values for all subcategories of the category selected using the category selector on the top of the grid. The grid also shows the total and average values for the revenue and units sold. You can use the panel selector on the top right to switch to another panel in the dashboard. The regional panel enables you to choose the region for which you want to display the data. For example, the central growth trends plots the revenue growth across months in 2016 for each category in each call center. The daily revenue section uses a time series slider to plot the revenue and revenue forecast over time, displaying the data in a macro view in the top graph and a micro view in the bottom graph. To view yet another panel in the dashboard, you can switch the city panel. This panel displays the KPIs for the selected city with conditional formatting applied to the KPIs that exceed or fall below expectations. The monthly revenue line graph lets you select a specific month. When you select a month, the year-over-year -year detailed growth grid changes to display the corresponding subcategory data for that month. By clicking the detailed report link, you can view a report that displays the detailed information for the selected city in the city panel. Thank you for listening to this video.